How to plan, manage, and schedule social media content with Planable. First things first, we need to open up our browser. And here, just type in planable.io and you will be routed to the platform. So just a brief background of Planable. Planable is actually a free social media collaboration and management tool trusted by marketers to plan, collaborate, and approve and schedule their social media posts. So it also allows users to create content for multiple pages and adapt them to different social media platforms separately. So in here, you can see if you want to sign up, just click on that green button. And here you could log in in the upper right hand corner. So I do have an account already and I've logged in a while ago. So let's go to my Planable account. Here, this is our dashboard basically for Planable or what we call workspace. So if you're still new, you'll just see create a workspace. But as for me, I've made one already. Okay, so below we could also see other workspaces or sample workspace. Let's click on that one. Okay, so this is a sample workplace for a juice company, which has Juice Coda as its brand name. So this is how the Instagram account looks like. All right, as you can see here, there are like people commenting on this certain post. So you are teaming up or you can use this with different people and collaborate with them, basically, with your teammates. So in this page here, up, we can see our linked social media accounts. And by the way, you can also import posts, export posts, and click on page settings to show list. Okay, for filter and sort here, we can see the approved list. Okay, so which post have, has been approved and not approved. Next is the post status. So you'll see here um, which post is to be scheduled, uh, published, has no date and whatnot. Next is our feedback activity is that what I mentioned a while ago, you will be collaborating with other people as well. So they might leave some comments or maybe like your manager is going to look onto the post. So yeah, here in our labels, you can actually put labels to your um, posts. So yeah, here for the period, it's like how many posts or how many activities that are due for the week. You could also customize if you would like to check on a customized date or a certain period. Next is the post type. Basically for Instagram, we have the post stories, reels, and whatnot. Next is our content. So it will show us like how many images, videos, GIF we've posted on this account. And lastly, our author section here, we can see the members and um, the collaborators. Okay, here you could also hide team only posts. So let's click on that one. Basically, we don't have one. So let's just reset on our filters. And in the bottom part of filter and sort um, box, you can actually see like archived posts from before. All right, so this is what we call the feed view, by the way, guys. Um, there is another way of looking into, and that's the calendar view. So let's take a look at the platform in a calendar view. All right, so basically it's a calendar of activities here, and you'll see the activities and if you move your cursor, you will see whether this post has been approved, disapproved, and like some comments as well. So this is for this week. All right, let's click on the next week there. Okay, you could also view this on a monthly basis. So there you have it. All 
All right, so let's take a look at on our other platforms like Facebook, for instance. So this is our calendar view for Facebook. Now let's go back to our feed view. All right, so this is how our fee Facebook account looks like for Juzgo. Right, you can also see here our Twitter account, Instagram, and other platforms. Okay, so let's try creating a story. Basically, let's create a post. Okay, so for stories, we can see here different options, like you can upload an image or a video from your computer. You could also add a text to the story and add media library if you do have like files already saved. Okay, so for posts here, we can um, upload images, add GIF, add from library. Let's add a GIF for this video or for this post, basically. So let's take a look at for healthy juice. Since our brand is healthy soda. Okay, here, let's make use of this picture. Okay, now all we need to do is to type in um, a description. So stay hydrated and healthy. There you have it. Now below you can see here save and there's a drop down beside it. So you can choose if you'd schedule or publish it. So if I click on schedule, you can see here different um, time. So for example, let's pick Tuesday at 11.15, okay, there. And you could also publish it directly. All right. Now let's hit on schedule if everything's good already and you're satisfied with the post. Okay, so there you have it. We have scheduled and posted a GIF on our workspace or Instagram account. If there is a moderator on your workspace, basically he or she needs to approve that one. However, if you're working alone, then you would be the one uploading or like managing it on your own. So yeah, okay, let's go to my workspace this time. So here I've tried creating a workspace and I have linked in a mock-up Instagram account and a mock-up TikTok account. So here in our Instagram account, you can see that there has been a story being added. And in our TikTok account, um, I have added a label in here. And there is our story. All right, that's about it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoy. Bye.